Hi there and welcome back to Skyden. Um, so in the last episode I made myself my uh, XP farm. I have a ton of XP right now, I didn't even notice that. Uh, so I'm going to have to go and get some more enchanted swords to get rid of some of it. Um, but I, I've just been thinking a lot about the... Um, The wood turning to iron. Um, I'm not sure how efficient it is, but I, I was just sitting here for a while just doing this. And um, it's not too bad. It would be cool if there's some way to automate it. Um, I can get as far as this, this, but I can't cut it down is the only f unfortunate thing. Um, otherwise it would be cool. But yeah, so I can do this a couple of times, which is not too bad. And um, we just get a ton. Oh, whoops! We can get some wood, and with the wood, I can turn it into. Uh, So that's, it's not too much wood, but it's not a load of wood either. Um, so I'm sure there is a better way of doing that. So then the idea is that we turn the wood, two wood into obsidian, and four obsidian into iron, which isn't great. I'm sure there's a much by, better way of doing that, but we do have a lot of iron. And we can turn that iron into gold? No, it must be full set, is it? Yeah. I wonder, it might be more efficient to turn it to gold using Tomecraft. Um, I think I figured that out, but I can't remember. Problems with skipping days. Anyway, I'm going to go to uh, Skyden and enchant some more swords. So I'm back at the enchanting table and um, I left some swords and stuff in here. So let's grab some swords. So I have 21. Um items are not items 21 levels so let's um put looting three will i get three onto it no 27 18 27 18 will work. And then I have another three. So I think that should get sharpness one will get on that. And maybe not back one. No. Losing one? No. Okay, so I just put sharpness one on that. That's fine. Now the other thing that I have here is I have these things that I got off the mobs and I can smelt these in the alloy furnace for five gold um, so um, but only if they're fully repaired so what I can do is I can spend a level and transfer this fire protection one onto this one using this so now I have two of these, and now I can repair this another one level. But this doesn't smelt, it seems. Okay, so it's just the gold stuff. That's cool. Good to know. I'll keep this one that I can transfer it onto the gold ones. and Or even just take it later. So let's go back um, to my base, and we'll do some more stuff. So back at the base, um, we're going to use the alloy furnace to melt down 
The gold helmet. And the gold pants. And these gold I took from the gold nuggets that I got from a previous envelope and just made them into actually ingots. And there we are. Wow, that's really efficient. Hmm. So, diamonds are for gold. So I get six diamonds. Pretty cool. Okay, now I was looking it up and I'm fairly certain that it is more efficient to convert using uh, Thumbcraft. So let's go ahead and get some smooth sandstone, if I have any left. I don't have a lot. And get some from cobble. I'm fairly certain this is just gonna cause a load more wisps though. So it might be better just to go using um, the minimum stone. Can I do it this way? Mm, not as good. Although, what's that? This stone, no. So what do we want to do again? So I think it's four cobblestone is flint. See, I can't even remember. Smooth stands, sandstone, chiseled, uh, chiseled, chiseled. Sandstone is sand or two gravel. Uh, can we make gravel? Can't even remember how I did this. Sand. Wow, really? I'm gonna just check my video and see how I did this. Oh, it was stupidly silly. It's just to grass, grass goes to sand. Stupidly silly. So let's just get a load of this stuff because we might need it. That to sand, that to sand, and that to sand. It really does wear out this minimum stone though. Um, and then for sand together, it gives me smooth stone, or sandstone. And then is it that? Smooth sandstone, there we go. So, damn wisps. Oh wait, no, I think the green one's okay, unless you attack it. Oh no, I think I attacked it. Can I do anything with these wispy ash essences? Um, I don't know. I don't think so. They're probably used in something, but I don't know what. So we need one of these to four. One to two. Oh, it does have extra stuff though. That's why all the wisps are coming.
Those trees still haven't grown though. Two, so I need two stacks. There's two stacks. Wand. Can I do it all at once? I can. But I am pumping stuff into the air here. I'm gonna have loads of wisps after me in a minute. There we are, loads of gold. And that was, I think, that was one to one. Just about. Fourteen, and then if we just get another bit of gold, there we go, another three diamonds. And I'm definitely going to have to make another minimum stone. Damn. Okay, so nine diamonds. Still not enough. Let's uh, go get some more XP. I need another iron sword. Not iron sword. A stone sword would be fine. Let's go collect some uh, XP. And hopefully some more um, armor, actually. Okay, so I'm just gonna sit here and collect some XP for a while. Um, I'll be back if anything interesting happens, so until then, I will see you in a bit. So I got myself a whole load of levels, which is cool. Um, and I want to... No, you're not going to attack. I want to make myself some brass. Uh, and why I'm making brass will come clear in a while. So it's three copper to one tin. So I need to use Thumbcraft to make copper, which is apple and three metal. So let's just get my apple here. That's two. So I can do six to one apple. So I just make as much of these. So if I get. So six. So one apple will do six. So that's three. So that should be. And I'm sure this is just going to have loads of effect. So there's a whole load of copper. Cool. And now tin is glass stuff, which is also two to one. And I think it's three as well. It is. So five. Oh, I think I lost count there. So each one of these will do six, 24, it's four, and then you need another three. So that should be enough.
10, cool. And then we'll just make these into ingots. And I've just realized that I don't think I actually have the things that I want to make these, so I might... Yeah, I'm fairly certain I don't have the things that I want in order to make these stuff. Uh, so instead, I'm going to make myself a diamond sword to replace this ruby sword that's about to die. I'm also going to bring a ton of gold our gunpowder to exchange for gold. So let's go to Skyden. So back in Skyden we can uh, trade with fists with the gunpowder. This should give me a decent amount actually. Not too bad. Um, I might even get a diamond from that. Cool. Uh, and then let's go make this uh, diamond sword. And then let's... Can we move this? Cool, that was only cost two, which was cool. So I can just waste the rest of that sword anyway. So let's take the rest of these enchantments uh, uh, levels and let's just put sharpness V, well that's 33. Sharpness four, 21. And put knockback one on it, 27. Cool. So what else is it here that we need? Well, um, yeah, unfortunately, I think, ah, here we go. That's what I want. We get some redstone. And uh, let's go head back. So we're back here and we want to now make some things. So first thing I want to do is make a screwdriver. Yes, a screwdriver. And then we want to make some transposers. Uh, two should be enough. Um, so we need the wood. So two is fine. And I'm probably also going to need a um, a clock, isn't it? A timer. Uh, which is going to need a whole load of these. And I'm going to make that off camera because they are so annoying to make. Um, and where are we going to use this? Well, we're going to use it up here instead of the funnels that I said, or the hoppers even, that I said I'd make last time. But why do we need the bronze? Well, the bronze can be used to make, and because I need more sand now. Some sand. And smelt the sand. We get some glass. So this we need some um, pneumatic tubes. 
But we're also gonna make some uh, redstone alloy wire. I think it's just... Yep, it's just iron and redstone. So we can make some of that as well. So I'm going to make the, um, whatever it was, timer quickly off screen and we'll be back in a second. So I have my glass and we can make ourselves some, uh, pneumatic tubing. Uh, cool stuff. I already had a screwdriver. When did I build that? Weird. Uh, let's just take these trees out so we can put this stuff in. So, we're kind of going a bit over time, but I want to put these transposers in here now. Um, now we have to be careful up here because it is a bit explosive. There you go. You see the creepers are blowing up all over the place. You have to get them before they get you. And I'm out of a pickaxe. Oh no, there's a cool... So let's drop down under here. There should be enough standing room so I can clear out all this. I have to brighten it up as well. Okay, we're well over time, so I will have to finish this, clear this out, and finish this next episode. Sorry about that. Okay, I will see you later then.